Right guys, this is the cheapest way to get yourself a quick release steering wheel on your Logitech or any other wheel with a similar sort of base. Right, so, started with the OMP and bought a like plastic adapter which is 3D printed off eBay for roughly 15 quid or something like that. Which is all well and good, did the job. But, if you're like me, and you weren't fortunate enough to have another computer for other games, when you're playing anything other than racing or any trucking games, you have find your wheel sits too high and you can't see the screen properly. So, quick release is the way to go. Now you can look on eBay and you can find quick release systems for about 35 quid, which are the plastic 3D printed, and it's some sort of bicycle bloody quick release clamp. Anyway, we've gone car standards. This is off a bloody car, right? I'll put the link in the description. This thing was £8.50, I think. Link will be in the description. And guys, honestly, this is a way to roll. Right, so it's got your standard fittings on the hub itself, so it goes straight to your wheel. Looks all nice and professional. And then you move over to your base. And this is basically what you clip onto, right? So I can't really show you properly here, but if you look at your original wheel, you've got your uh, your bolt pattern, which obviously on this base didn't have any what lined up with these. So you pretty much had to drill your own. So if you don't have one of these to use as a template, to template the holes onto this back plate, then what I suggest is you use a wheel, you use these holes, you use the back of this plate, you get it dead center, then you mark the holes. But don't do what I did guys, because it's off center if you do. I went in line, you see these hole, these top holes here? I went in line with these originally, but my wheel were off to cock. So what you've got to do is you've got to clip your wheel onto your back plate first, then line it straight or near as damn it, and then you mark where the holes need to be. That is the easiest way. This hole setup costs in the region. Minus this, we'll forget about this. Just say you've just bought a G920 and you want to convert it into a full size wheel. Wheel was about 30 quid. I'll try and find the link for that and I'll put that up as well. Um, and the base plate, uh, the quick release, £8.50. Jobs are good on less than 50 quid, guys. You can have yourself a full on quick release wheel. Now, a few things I will point out while we're here is obviously there's a bit more weight to it. It doesn't affect it, but I would recommend when the wheel starts up to calibrate, just leave it off. Every time you finish your racing game, clip it off. Then when you fire your computer up, it'll do its calibration thing and there's no weight there to, to send it crazy. And it'll, obviously it'll last a bit longer. Secondly is there we go, she's on. Secondly, your flappy paddles. I bought these, and I bought the wrong ones to start with. But if you get your deep dish flappy paddles, you should be good. Where at the minute, obviously with the depth of the quick release and the wheel, they're, they're a bit, bit away. Which is fine for indications and stuff, but if you're gear changing, it might be a bit awkward. But that's not the end of the world, guys. You can get deep dish ones of these. I just had the, the flat ones and I, I curved them into shape. So you probably get a lot more depth on them. Also, I got the deep dish wheel. If you've got the flat wheel, you would be so much closer to them flappy paddles, it would be better. So if I was to recommend you guys to get this set up, I would go with a flat wheel and this adapter and you guys are sorted. But you can see what I mean when you sat here, the wheel, top of the wheel is just cutting some of the screen off. Which, in the end of the world, but how much better is it when you can just do that? 
thank you very much but yeah that is the ultimate way and the cheapest way honestly guys get yourself on ebay get it ordered it is a way to roll hope this video helped you because i found this my own way i took the the gamble as such which wasn't much of a gamble for eight quid but i took the gamble it it worked it pulled off and if you guys have got any questions just leave them in the comments below and i will try and answer them until then we'll catch you later